Hi folks, welcome to Benjamin's Demon Hunter. To start, here's a quick look at the talents that I recommend taking. This is a little different than what I used. This is posted in the description below. Uh, fight me on anything you think I should have taken. And here's the videotape. Just remember, Demon Spikes isn't going to do much for you in this phase other than the Calcified Spikes damage reduction, which it maxes out at 12%. It's not a big deal. Demon Hunter already has a good amount of passive magic damage mitigation, which is cool. And you do have several options of dealing with drain life from range. Your kick is range if you're talented into it. You can sigil. The only reason I killed that eye is because it was there and I didn't want to go into the puddle yet, so it was like, why not, right? And you can see there's empowered soul cleaves. It's going to town and Fiery Brand is like a Colossus Smash damage window with the talent setup that we have, so when that's up, try to be putting as much fire damage into it as you can. I think it amps fire damage by 20? 20%? Something. So this is a little tasty. We jump right on the orb. We're going to fell dev these guys down. I think I was just kind of wait waiting for them all to be right there. Which is kind of dicey. You don't really want them anywhere near. Also, Mind Run for Demon Hunter does AoE damage. See this? Boom. Just like it does for Demon, uh, Death Knight, which is uh, not a Demon Knight. And Varus, compared to Baron Blood Death Knight, does have a chunky bit of health. So many knockoff threat mechanics in this fight. They're just like, yeah, slap another 100k on it. And then we're going to Sigil, boom. Just get rid of those ads. Don't actually tank them. They apply a debuff, which increases their damage to you, and they will mow you down super duper fast, way faster than you think. So don't actually tank them. Get threat and get away. And you can try to position infernals. I, I would, you just ignore eyes, ignore infernals, ignore anything that knocks you around. And you just hit spacebar if it knocks you. I'm gonna bind this one or uh yeah, I'm prisoner rather. You see, this is dangerous here. They're casting Nether Storm, which they cast on the move for Demon Hunter. They don't do that for like Death Knight, for example. But if they were to be channeling that, you see how close Valen is right there? That is uh that is a dicey sitch. Anyway, we get on the orb, so it's no big deal. A half second of that would have been would have been the way to go, and there's my graphics card. And sometimes you just gotta target them all down, and that's fine. And not transitioning with four ads debuffing you and a bunch of other problems going on. We transition rather well. So annihilate. The first one, you don't need to do anything at all. You'll probably have a fiery brand up, or you'll pro probably be in meta anyway, so just just roll with it. And then you're going to kick Twisted Reflections right there, and we're just backing up. Remember, we're always backing up, and this is, again, it's not out of respect for the Infernal. It's just kind of habit. Every other tank I do this on, every other tank I do this in the challenge. And this is more dicey, so that's an orb. I'm thinking, where's my spear bomb right about now? We hunt something, we hunt cruel, and another orb. Yeah, look at that. And we fell dead, this annihilate, second annihilate, no big deal. And I get away with murder about 40 seconds from now. Ads are coming up, we're just keeping puddles away from Velen, just because you're not always jumping, right? You don't want to, he's got enough green. And that's as much tanking as I would ever do to these ads. And I sigiled, right? Misery, so. And here it comes. See what we got here. Oh, we have Fiery Brand. Okay, so this is 40% reduction. Oof. It was like 15k. All I had was calcified spikes. I didn't have any armor from Demon Spikes. I didn't have follow anything up. So funny. And that's how you go cruel on Vengeance Demon Hunter. Pretty easy. Also, if these kill Velen after you kill Cruel, you lose the challenge. Very holy priesty. Just kill him. Don't stand on Velen. Goodness. Folks, I want to thank you for watching. If you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button. I'm pretty sure it blinks these days.
hit that like button if you like the video and that bell if you want to be notified when the next video comes out and please share with your friends thanks again guys take care